When getting to work with Unreal Engine 4 for the first time, you need to work within a project file in order to complete your game. Projects are great because they allow you to work with Unreal in a very organized and efficient manner. Because Unreal Engine 4 now works exclusively with the new project system, it's important to understand how to use this new system to its full potential. When you start up Unreal for the first time, you'll be presented with the Unreal Project browser window. At this point, you pretty much have two choices. You can either open an existing project, for example, a project you've worked on before or downloaded, like an example project from Epic Games, or you can create a brand new project from scratch. In this video, we'll learn how to create a new project from scratch. So to do that, all you need to do is click on the New Project tab, and you'll be presented with several options. For example, we can create a new blank project, or we can choose a template that can get us kick-started with our new project. For example, uh, first-person shooter type games, we've got templates for side-scroller games, all kinds of cool things. Your choice depends on the goals of your project and what you intend to create with Unreal. So first, let's select a blank project and then what you want to do is give the project a new name. So in the bottom left we can see that it has the default My Project name. You can give that whatever you want. So if you want to give your uh, game a code name, which is pretty common practice in most studios, you can do that. Then you can click this button here in the lower right, and this will show you the actual location of the project. So this is the default location. I strongly recommend um, choosing a custom location. Uh, for example, in my workstation, I have several extra hard drives hooked up to my system, so I could choose a folder in a different hard drive uh, where I have more space for all of these different uh, project files, uh, original asset files, and all that stuff. These projects can get pretty big. Then just click on the Create Project button, and you're done. 